Hey guys, Tommy Jordan here. Before I race this thing, an FPV racer, I need to practice my skills first. So I downloaded this game, FPV Free Rider. It's a game that was only $5. I got off the web. You can try the demo version of it free to make sure it works in your computer and everything. It's just like racing and the graphics are fantastic. Take a look. So it's called FPV Free Rider, and as I said, it is free. You can fly with either FPV or just looking at the drone line of sight there. You can also choose whether you want to do acro, 3D, or stable. And then you can also choose how responsive, high or low responsiveness there as well. So in this example here, this is the free version. We have, we're flying to the desert, we're doing FPV. And what I did was I downloaded this version right here, the free one, and practiced and flew it through the desert here. and. It worked. I have Windows 10 and it works. So download it for free. I've got the direct link for direct link for you below. Go ahead and download that and see if it works on your computer. And if it does, give it a try and see how much you like it. If you like it, great. If not, you know, no big deal. It's free. Why not, right? What I like about the desert one, uh, oh yeah, you can also flip, you can do rolls with this, which is really nice. You saw I did a roll there. I love that sunset. That sunset's really, really cool. I know what you're thinking. Geez, getting giddy over a video game sunset. Yeah, it looks looks cool. I'm into the sunsets, okay? And there's our flip coming up. I did a slow flip. But I really like this one. So this was free, and I liked it so much, I was so impressed. I went ahead and spent five hours and I paid for the actual thing. Now I do have a controller. I bought the controller uh, on Amazon. It's a controller that you just plug in with a USB into the computer. So you will need to purchase a controller to control this unless you already have one already. So this is the controller I use. It's the eSky Simulator controller. And I got it on Amazon for $39 back in the day. It's just a basic controller, but it works really, really well. Your trims and everything, doesn't have anything else, no on-off switch or anything. You could probably pick this up on eBay for $20, $25. It works by USB plug. You just plug this into your computer, very easy. So you will need to calibrate your controller, make sure it works correctly. And every now and then you'll need to recalibrate it to uh, reset the settings and everything. Not too often. I, you know, if it, if it starts flying funny, you just recalibrate it. But uh, pretty simple to do. And of course, you can also fly line of sight, which is really, really neat. I personally practiced flying line of sight first for a little bit. I just wish that the drone had little lights to help me identify the orientation because when it flies further away it gets a little bit tricky to see the orientation of the drone but it's still pretty cool and need to fly this thing in acro line of sight just to see how it works i'd rather practice this game first crash and learn than crash and learn on this thing so the game also has custom settings to set up your controller to where you like it. You'll notice the default angle of the camera is actually 24 degrees, where all the other angles are at 30. And I personally fly at snappy, and but it's kind of cool. Eventually I'll work my way up to snappy 2 and 3. You can also change the FPV sound and uh, again, a lot of all these other settings, how it flies, you can control all that. Really, really cool. So flying on the playground is what I think may be the most challenging. The playground and flying in the garage. I love the playground. It's the biggest challenge on this game. So it's a lot of fun. Very rewarding to be able to fly through all this playground equipment. And the other one I like a lot is the garage. The garage is also really, really challenging. There's three levels to the garage. First, second, third floor. And right now we're in the middle level. And... Uh, I like to fly out of the garage. And as I said earlier, you can do rolls with this game. You can also do flips. And it's fun to fly around the garage and then to fly back inside. Pretty, really, pretty cool. We'll go ahead and just uh, fly back inside so you can see how it looks. We'll go ahead and fly back in now. The island is also a lot of fun. I love flying the island. It's a very simple format, just a few structures that you fly through and pretty much the most fun thing about the island really is just flying through the tower i just like flying through that thing there's also a lot of really cool trails on the island another thing about the island that i think is really cool you can actually fly off or over the deep end that's cool the meadow is also really cool it's just like flying in the desert you're flying through these gates 
and a lot of fun and flying through the tower it's pretty simple you just kind of go as it's really about speed and practicing your speed going as fast as you can but a lot of fun so my personal favorite is the two towers this is just a really really nice flying feel absolutely love it you fly through the towers flying through the trees doing flips on here Everything about this, I really like this feel. This is my personal favorite. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this demo. This is a cool game for $5. It's a no-brainer. I'd rather pay $5 and learn, plus the controller cost, before I pay three, four hours to buy a brand new drone that's ruined. Practice on this thing, right? I'm Tommy Drone, hope this helps. I'll talk to y'all next time. So thanks for watching, I'm Tommy Drone and this was my review of the FPV free rider video game. But also, like I said, for $5, you really can't beat it. And uh, But I would even go so far as to say, go ahead and download it for free. And even buy yourself a controller if you don't have it, $30. It's a great way to practice. I've been wanting to get an FPV for a while. And this game has really helped me out a lot with getting better at my FPV skills. So now I'm ready to do it for real. So stick around. Please like and subscribe. Got a lot more awesome videos on Time Drone. Talk to you next time.